What's up, everybody? I'm Sniggenhoff, and we are back once again playing EU4 with the MNT 2.0 mod installed. That's Tuscany. Um, on the last episode, we won another coalition war, another punitive war, if you will. And um, yeah, so because of that, I'm thinking about going to war. Hooray! So, Remini is still only allied to Genoa. So if I go to war with them, I can pull Genoa into a war. And while I can't co-belligerent them because they're allied to Milan, the Papal State, and Remini, and they are also have their independence guaranteed by Lithuania, I could just not co-belligerent them and take their land anyway. Might cost a little bit of aggressive expansion, but who knows. Um, I would, however, if I do that, I'd want to get military access from Aragon so I can land troops over here so I can take Corsica. So, let me pull this dude back, because currently they wouldn't give it to me, but they're only negative 17 reasons away, and most of that is them not liking me. So, let's improve relations with Aragon some. And in the meantime, let me build uh, a couple of transports. Because, I mean, they've only got four troops over here, but if I'm able to, if I can just land some troops down over here, should be able to make it work. It's a year away before I can do that anyway, so. We'll just chill for a sec. Um, the trade wharf that I built is almost done. And after that is done, I should... Plague has killed 5% of population. Well, that kind of sucks. It's not terrible, but it does... It is hitting. Pogrom against the Protestant faith. They will burn for this. There's some pretended rebels rising up. Um, what was I just talking about? Ravenna, why'd you go reformed? Why you gotta do this to me, bro? Oh yeah, I was looking at this. Now I just need 600 ducats. And then if I own 100 cities, I can wear an imperial crown. And I'm still a little ways away from this, so. Perugia University, class of 1517. Five prestige or five admin in one dip. Let's take the prestige. All right, would you give me military access now? You would. Let me ask for that first. Hopefully they don't cancel it after I declare the war. Uh, do I have a claim on Remini? Probably not. But I might. Let me see. I do! Janoa would join in. over to here. Uh, heavily restrict the looting. You go and blockade enemy forts in the Mediterranean.
I need to make sure this straight is blockaded. Looks like it is. Twenty nine days till these ships are done. wonder how much aggressive expansion am I going to incur from this. Forty-four for just that one province. Okay, what if I didn't take that? Okay, that's ten. That's twenty. Alright, so I'm not taking this province, huh? Yeah, it is twenty-six pop. So I'm taking this, that, and that essentially. Age of Reformation. Hooray. Um, converted to the state religion. Please. over to guys the good leader uh, the Emilian brethren believing in electing priests scriptural proof okay we've had this so we either demand drown their leaders for violating lose 10 military power encourage them to move elsewhere drown their leaders get out of here Hungary has been placed under an interdict. Uh, yeah, send them a message of solidarity for sure. Sixteen day siege ticks here. Hopefully I can end this war before uh, before I go take out a loan. How did I gain an extra diplomatic or did I lose a diplomatic relation slot? Not entirely sure, but I can actually cancel this with uh, you guys. Should have... Yeah, I'm 5 out of 5 now. Not sure why that pop-up was still there. Seekers of ill fortune. Gain 10 piety or lose 10 piety. Get a religious scandal either way. Do I want piety? Boys will be boys. Got the siege. Oh, 
overall just 20 aggressive expansion all your monies tenth of the treasury of course expansion in Italy is not welcomed turn that down turn those off and we'll start coring soon and you guys come back large revolts over here actually Send missionaries to our neighbors. Sure. Purente, Galura. Let's help out Verona. Got the Peasants' War taking up again. Which means I should probably stop rooting out corruption. For a little while. Hey dudes, protect trade and the Tyrrhenian Sea, please. Firenze never got hit with the plague. Crazy. 20 pop city. Improvements in land technology? Yeah. Are you the largest city on the subcon subcontinent? I think you probably are. Yeah. Yeah, you are. Yeah. Um, no leader, please. And what to do now? Let's go ahead and build up a spy network on the papal state. No, you know what? Let's uh, improve with outraged countries. Oh no, not, not you. You. You're blockading the uh, They're out here blockading the um, the the what call it provinces, the the rebel provinces. So I'm technically at war with them because they're rebels. Can you guys come back, please? Thank you. Bayer Munich is now Protestant. Croatia is now Protestant. And our ruler just died, it looks like. And we lost our personal union with Hungary. Massive celebration. How did we lose the personal union with Hungary? Well, that sucks. 
My prestige is like an 86. Well, I don't have the aggressive expansion probably to get back in on them. Although... I could go for it right now and call Savoy in. I mean, I don't want to lose them. And Restoration of Union should be a little bit different, right, in terms of aggressive expansion? Will I be able to get military access from you? No. Let's improve with you for a little bit. Or I could get it for I could go through Trent and Austria. Before they get allies, let's go ahead and declare the war. Austria is fighting Milan, and Milan is losing. Blockade enemy ports. do I get across? Um, let them loot. Improve here. Drown their leaders. Table State excommunicated Venice. Verona has been integrated, and Passau has the Peasants' War. I don't really feel like transporting them two at a time, but that may be what I have to do. I can't build any more transports, can I? I can build one. around to Verona. Royal marriage from Wartenburg. No, I'm good. Should have complete control of the seas. Yeah. Alright, two at a time it is. charge of one of these armies. And hopefully their army doesn't come over here and smash my little remnants of one. You wouldn't happen to want to give us military access now, would you? Now, why are you even more mad at me now?
I don't even know. I don't even know. Um, let's raise autonomy in those two provinces to avoid some uh, unrest issues. I'm very lucky that they're not just sending their army over here to just destroy me. Alright, how much aggressive expansion is the restoration of a union going to cost me? 74. Great. Great. Well... We'll deal with that on the next episode. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed the video, feel free to hit that like button down below as well as subscribe to the channel and leave me a comment. Why in the world did I leave, lose the lose the uh, thing in the first place? Huh? What happened there? I don't even know. Anyways. Oh, that's also why the Hungarian army isn't necessarily marching straight towards me is because uh, Saxony was keeping them busy. Anyways, once again, thank you guys so much for joining me and I will see you next time.